you know, I guess how excited you are to work with him as your position coach. Uh, my relationship with Coach Shannon is going great. I've known him since, like, since my recruitment process started when he was at UCF. And he's a great person, and we're still building that relationship. And I know I can count on him for any – well, call on him for anything and just stuff like that. I'm just uh, glad to be – I'm glad that he's my um, position coach because he's been in the game for a long time, and he's coached a lot of great. So I know he can bring me a lot of knowledge and stuff like that. Zach? Blowstein with 247. Hey, Omar, what's going on? Good, Zach. Um, you know, when we spoke before you enrolled at FSU, you kind of mentioned that you hadn't been in the weight room as much due to your, your senior season ongoing and all that. Now that you're in, you're enrolled and you're in a college strength and conditioning program, what's that been like for you? Uh, it's been great and pretty humbling because, like, you just got to learn, like, techniques. So it's basically just, like, you learn it from the beginning. And it's been great. I'm doing a lot of workouts that I've never done before, doing a lot of, like, stuff. I'm being pushed to limits that I never knew I could reach. And it's just – it's great so far. Brendan Sinai, 247. Hey, Omar. Uh, I wonder if you could kind of just give us a, br a breakdown of your game, like what you think you do well, things that you're trying to work on here at your freshman season. Uh, Things I do well, I feel like my instincts is very, very good. My speed. Um – if I'm asked to pass rush, I feel like I can pass rush. Um, just things like that, and um, I'm work. I'm trying to. I'm gonna try to work on like with my knowledge on the game, just watching film, like knowing the plays, and just learning uh football better. Ira, you know, talking to Coach Fuller when you signed, you know, he talked about you being a, a playmaker. You know, you 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 force turnovers. You're around the ball a lot. Um, what, what do you think the key to that? You talked about your instincts. Is that really the key to it? Or is it, um, you know, just the experience you've had playing football? What do you think helps you make uh, big plays? Uh, I feel like my instincts and just like my experience playing football, because I've been playing it since I was four. So just the experience and instincts and just all the preparation that I do, like it helps me. Brendan? Do you have an idea of what position specifically at linebacker they're going to start you at? Um, inside backer, just normal linebacker. Okay. Chris, Omar, have you kind of leaned on any of the uh, veteran guys in that room, maybe a Kalen or somebody of that sort, just get a feel for what to expect when spring rolls around? Um, I'm well, really the whole linebacker group, really guys like Amari, Kalen, and BJ, they're really like guys that I can be comfortable around. Like they're just teaching me, like they're just making me feel welcome. Just like if I mess up on something, they're telling me it's all right. And just like, they're telling me how to do things and just like, just how, yeah, basically just how to do things and just how to make myself better. Ira? Man, on, uh, on signing day, when, when a couple things didn't go Florida State's way, I'm, you went on social media and kind of try to tell everybody to relax and, and things are going to be fine. Have you always kind of been like a leader? Is that your personality to try to step up in times like that? Yes, sir. Because I know like um during that day, a lot of fans were going crazy and stressing and stuff like that. But I was just trying to tell them like everything's okay. It's just like, of course, never really got us heading in the right direction. And yeah, I've basically always been like that. Brenda? Saw the other day on social media that that you uh, got to stop into Michael Alford's office, have a cookie. I took him up on the opportunity to come in anytime. I guess what was that experience like, and to talk to the athletic director, and I guess what prompted you to go go on into his his office and, and meet him. Um, he's a great person, and like he has great energy, and I feel like he has great plans for Florida State. And um, just what happened that day is just I had free time. You know we have a busy, busy schedule, but I had free time that day, and I just thought it was a great idea to go introduce myself to the um, athletic director and just take a cookie also while, while I'm at it. And, yeah, like, he's a great person. I'm excited for the future, man. Ira? What, what was it – and I know you talked about it some during the recruiting process, but but uh, what was it about Coach Norvell and his vision that, that had you so committed, um, even though they didn't have the best season – last season? Um, what, may you re please restate that question again? Sure, sorry. Um, what, what was it, uh, what is it about Coach Norvell that had you so sold on his vision to stick with Florida State, even though, you know, they didn't have a great season last season? 
Um, really, I just believed in him. Just like just seeing how the, how much fight the team had, just just everything that he talked about. It was just like I could see it in the team. Like just the team never laid down during games or anything like that. It just really, I just believe in Coach Aslan with Fortune. Hey Omar, seeing the the offense, you know, go seven on seven or you know throw routes against air and doing the stuff that you're doing off the field in terms of workouts, are you kind of getting a feel for how different the game is going to be at this level, and how are you kind of processing those things right now? Honestly, haven't yet, but like I'm really just seeing like like how the game is going to be at it. I'm I'm really just seeing how the game is going to be just because like a lot of things matter, like all the small things matter, and that's what um. Coach Norvell and the staff, that's just what they're, like, teaching us. Like, all the little things matter. Any other questions for Omar? Okay, we're all set. Thank you.